when the Lamb opened the seventh seal, silence covered the sky. Salam tenat hinaist ling, ine ras yadinos teferi neng. I am Ras Yadino Stefari, um, Wendem Yadun, brother Yadun of the Lineages Society of His Imperial Majesty, and a member of the Ethiopian World Federation Incorporated. <coughs> Exodus. 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 Firstly, I would like to say to all the brothers and sisters, um, uh, Melkam Fasika Baal Derasachu. Um, may you have a beautifully good Fasika Passover Pesach this particular year, 2011, in the West, as it's known. And uh, the issue, the main issue, really the only issue, is freedom, is freedness, and it's on it, freedom from. Kabarnet from from slavery for us as the once lost but now found Beta Israel and as the elect Rastafari we as so called black people or as Afro Americans Afro Caribbean Afro uh, Hispanic people who recognize our true identity as Beta Israel must recognize and realize what time we're in and the signs of the time. And we need to all come to a decision and and to make a serious decision about the Al-Kidan, the B'nai Barat, the covenant, and our role, responsibility, um, our blessing, or the curses and the judgment for disobedience as well. Ethiopia, Ethiopia, Africa, our promised land is calling us, is, is, is waiting for us. And many of us are reasoning and discussing with one another, what shall we do? During the Passover time, Pesach, among the other Israel, among the, the other Jews, the European Jews, they have a, a tradition which also comes from our common and our roots as ethnic Hebrews, as black Hebrews from our root, where in exile we would say next time or next year, let it be in Jerusalem or next year, let it be in Jerusalem. Well, we are saying next year, may we be, I and I, be in Adesitu Jerusalem in Next year, may we be within Addisi to Jerusalem. Next year, may we have our Fasica and observe our high holy days and live according to our liberty, our way of life, in the gates of the African and Sion, African Zion. This message is to remind ones of, of the Exodus, the Exodus 2006, according to the Ethiopic calendar, which is... 2012, and the Holy Spirit said to put out this message to ones and ones, and I'll make it brief right now, but we need Exodus operators on the ground, Exodus operators on the ground. If this interests you, if you receive what this message is about, please contact and link with I and I, ASAP, because the signs of the times already are signaling us. We've, we've had abundant signs even over the last 10, 10 or more years, but especially as, as time goes on and we recognize the state of the world and, and the word of prophecy and the fulfillment in this time. Those brothers and sisters who are willing and able, please link with I and I so that ones and ones can begin this process for those who are willing, those who are able, and those who are in covenant. We need Exodus operators on the ground. We will explain more in detail after we reason and interview with the various different brothers and sisters who are interested, as well as those who have already linked with us, and some are already in preparation. Some have even begun and gone forward already. 
um, to be those exodus operators, the exodus operators and the co-laborers. And when the Lamb opened the seventh seal, silence covered the sky. Salam tanat hinaist ling, ine ras yadinos tefari neng. I am ras yadinos tefari, um, wendem yadun, brother yadun of the lineages, societies, and pro majesty.